Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to Ladder Up. Today we are three and three. Things are not going great. Um, I haven't really got to show off the coolness of Trevenant yet, which makes me sad because this team that I got from uh, Kevin Hanlon, by the way, uh, at Sky Burial on Twitter, who uh, you link to his, to his channel is in the description. Go check him out. He's using this team over there as well. My chair is squeaky. Oh my god. We got Samu with a, with a Gastrodon. So here. Is Trick Room the play? I don't know. This is like a crappier version of Wolf's team. Or maybe it's better. I don't know. Um, thing is, ladder just reset, so this could be a good player. Just low on the ladder. Probably not. But I think uh, Gastrodon, Politoed, uh, Trevenant's probably good here. Um, Metagross is pretty good here. I think. Uh, I think he's gonna just go offense, and I think I want to go. To go toad? No, the top of Coco is annoying. My own top of Coco might be the play. No, actually, I think the Gastrodon is the biggest problem here. Maybe I go. I don't know, that was weird. And then, I think I still want Top of Coco. I want the Toad. I think I want, yeah, I want Metagross. Which is weird, because I don't really have a good answer for the Magnezone, really. I mean, I can, ha my, my best answer, honestly, is Hammer Arm on Metagross. Which, if I get a Trick Room, is nice. It's super nice. The Gastrodon really can't do a ton to um, Trevenant. Top of Coco Gastron. Okay. Good. Good, 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 good. Where did we leave? This is good. This is so good. This is super good. Um, I was actually running Gastrodon at Athens Regionals, and I had a uh, bold, just uh, enough bulk to survive a grinding Z earthquake from Garchomp, and then the rest was in, like, um, special attack and it had sludge bomb and honestly did, it does a lot of damage to the opposing top of coco here i think i would protect if i could what else is in the back nothing wants to switch into a dazzling gleam really this gastrodon just gastrodon's not just going to sit here and want to take this I'm going to predict that he protects Gastrodon and switches to try and knock out his top of Coco. Because if I do that, I'm in a good position. He withdraws. So nothing's going to want to come into this. Magnezone. Alright, that's fine. Shiny Magnezone, too. That's pretty cool. So, we get a Dazzling Gleam off. If, if if we get a Horn Leech off here, that's very nice. He just goes for Dazzling Gleam, too. That's totally fine. Oh, he's Life Warp, too. So I think we're getting the better end of this deal. Especially since we're going to heal back. Yeah. Oh, we just barely missed the knockout. And it's Leftovers Magnezone. Okay. Uh, Trevenant is important here. I could probably switch in Metagross and we'd be okay. That's our best bet. If he wants to attack, with I don't want to risk a speed tie and I don't want to lose Tapu Coco just yet. Um, I think I'll protect here. Hopefully he'll knock himself out to Life Orb Recoil. That'd be super cool. Um, get the, um, get, get the Metagross in here. Because he might want to protect Tapu Koko and, like, Flash Cannon in the, into my Tapu Koko. I think this is okay. I think this is okay. But anyways, happy Friday, guys. Um, this battle is actually kind of intense thus far. But I asked you a question yesterday, uh... And I think I'm going to ask you another question today, but I'm not sure. How about... Okay, these are going to be very basic questions at first. How about, besides Pokemon, what video game do you play the most? Um, if Pokemon is your only video game, what, what do you do besides that? So he does protect. He, he's going to Flash Cannon here. So besides, if besides Pokemon, what video game do you play the most? And if, uh, if you don't play video games besides Pokemon, then... Uh, oh. The Reeds. I was not expecting that, and I should have been expecting that.
thing is, if that substitute is going to be super bulky, right? Do I want to risk it? I'm going to, I'm going to risk it. Because, you know, if he knocks me out, I'll get, I'll get Trevenant in for free. I can probably set up a trick room and we'll be good to go. Because I don't know if a Dazzling Gleam will break the substitute. He withdraws. Okay, so someone's going to come and Gastrodon... Muck. Okay. So I guess a Thunderbolt into the Magneton might have been better. This is still good damage. Substitute doesn't break on the Magazine, unfortunately. I do get the hammer arm off, so this is all right. He's got a flash cannon into my top of Coco, which is kind of annoying. Thunderbolt. Ow. This is tricky. I need to be faster than the muck. Oh, he's got magnet pull. I can't switch out. Oh no. I'm gonna switch out. I gotta get into a better position than this. Shadow sneak. Okay, cool. So in that case, he's probably going for a Thunderbolt into a top of Coco. Or a Substitute. This might be the time to get in Politoed, but I don't know. We already saw that that last Muck outsped Trevenant. Muck is... Uh, let's see, Muck here. 70. Yeah, what about min speed? <sighs> okay, I'm gonna go into Polytoad. I think it puts on more pressure if I can have rain up for my top of cocoa after this. Flash cannon. Okay. We resist that, so this is fine. Will Shadow Sneak even take out Metagross? I don't know. We heal back a lot of that damage. We, have, we don't have that. We have 252 on Muck. Shadow Snake does. Yeah, Shadow Snake will knock us out. So we just we just take that hit. But if he Shadow Sneaks, it's no big deal. Do I just let Polytoad take this? Or go on the, to the Trevs? I'm going to the Trevenant. Bait him into attacking it with something that's not going to really hurt it that much. I mean, Thunderbolt will do a decent amount. Shadow Snake. I completely forgot about Magnet Pull. But we survive. We might actually knock out the Muck here, which would be chill. Yeah, this should knock out the Muck, honestly. So it's not max attack. I was basing my, my calculation off of max attack muck, but clearly he's, he's running a very super bulky team, which means that his shadow sneak won't knock us out. However, he might survive this, but I don't think he will. This is a lot of damage. I That critical hit did not matter. At all. Um, meteor mash. Z move. Yeah, okay, so on max HP muck, min roll, um, one, it's, one, min roll is 
It's a guaranteed Oko. Guaranteed Oko. So that, that person's probably super salty, but whatever. Anyways, you usually don't invest a whole lot of defense and luck anyway, so we still have a really high chance to knock it out. Here's the thing. What else does he have? He has Gastrodon. Trevenant, I don't want it to go down just yet. I need it. But I really can't protect it, and I can't do a whole lot with Magnezone. So if he wants to attack... Oh, this is tricky. I'm just going to switch in Politoed, honestly. Yeah. This would be a good time for him to get up a substitute, honestly. Like, really good. I can't lose Tre I can't lose Trevenant because otherwise I cannot touch the Gastrodon. Polito's kind of dead weight at this point. Dazzling Gleam. Okay. He's going to knock himself out, which is cool. And if the Magnuson goes for a substitute here, I'm totally screwed. By the way. Flash Cannon. Okay, cool. So, play on the back burner right now, which is kind of annoying. Magnazone. <sighs> Magnazone, you suck. I want to know. Tapu Coco. Life Orb. Thunder. What does that do? Does a good amount. Prevents it from getting up a substitute. So do I bring in the Tapu Coco or bring in the Trevenant? I think I bring in the Tapu Coco, I just go for it. Does he protect the Magnazone is the question. I think he does. I think he does. I'm gonna go for a pair song. Because if I don't, can I win? Actually, maybe I can. Maybe I should just go for an attack here. Maybe I should play a bit, a bit more aggressively. Maybe I, maybe I volt switch. No, I thunder. I thunder here. And I will pair song. Because even if he knocks out Top of Coco, I should be okay. Okay, he doesn't protect, so good. This is good. This will do a lot. It's a like minimum 76. Oh. He's got a lot of special defense investment then to take it like that. So Gastrodon here is going to do something stupid. Scald, yeah, that's going to knock us out. Hmm. So if the electric terrain runs out here, this is actually really good. This is so tricky. Um, Gastrodon, Scald. Gastron's gotta protect here. Oh, an no, electric terrain's got like several turns left. Um. Can I survive a thing? No. He's going to protect. I got. I got to. I got to do this. I got to trick him because he's gonna protect Astrodon. No, he does. This guy doesn't care. Because I just. You're, you're joking. Oh, that was a mistake. Because I could just knock out the Gastrodon then. I literally just knock out the Gastrodon then. I need. I need my Citrus Berry. I need it. I need Harvest to activate. Oh, that was so bad. That was so bad. Because otherwise I just Horn Leech and I win the game. 
That was so, that was so bad. Oh, man. Oh, well. Yeah, because I'm up to full health then, and the Magazone can't touch me. That was so dumb. I just, I gave that game away. That was dumb. <laughs> it's not Min Speed Gastrodon. What? Also, that flash cannon does a lot. And our citrus berry doesn't... Really need our citrus berry to, uh, to activate. Actually, no, I just screwed myself over anyways, because I totally, um... Forgot, uh... This is gonna do nothing. But a uh, pair song, in this case, um, I would have lost anyways. Because the uh, the Trevenant would go down first, and then the Magna Zone, so I would have lost anyways. Ugh. That's annoying. That Magna Zone was a problem. Magna Zone was a huge problem. Why was Magna Zone such a big problem? Oh man. Okay, so... <sighs> I'm sorry, Kevin. I'm playing like garbage. I'm just I'm, I'm, I'm just honestly not used to the team. This is, it's not a bad team. It's a great team. It's a great team. I'm just playing like hot garbage. So if you want to see someone play like not hot garbage, go check him out on his channel, which is linked in the description. Anyways, we'll get one more battle, and then I'm going to call it quits for the week. And hopefully have something... Some some original for you next week. Um, I'm not saying this isn't original, but obviously I didn't make the team, so I mean I mean like original for me. So like I'll make something. Uh, continue battling. Continue the battle. So, uh, in talking to Kevin over the weekend um, at the tournament, he went six and three as well. He kind of like I was very close to you know just breaking that X two and then getting in, um, but. First of all, I can't believe that wasn't Min Speed Gastrodon. And secondly, the, uh... Yeah, he was telling me that, uh, you know, Trevenant just did the work for him. Like, he, he got, like, he got, like, you know, so many heart The Citrus Berry harvested, like, every single turn it could. And he was getting, like, Leech Seed recovery and stuff. And it was surviving, like, hurricanes and crap. I'm like, I want that life. I want that. Also, if he brings Top of Bulu here, I definitely want Trevenant, like, for sure. Um, is my duck faster than his duck? Probably not. Because he's probably running max speed, just 252, 252, which is... It's whatever. Um, Top Coco is probably good here. Well, no, because I don't have spread... The Marowak's going to be a problem. I might, honestly might want to just go duck. I wanna, might want to duck myself. Maybe I'll go Trick Room. Maybe I'll go Trick Room. What can you do to stop that? You can lead Muck, which would be annoying. Could lead Muck. Does the top of Coco, does my top of Coco get bopped by a Waterium Z? I think it does. Um, Muck's good here. Metagross, yay Siren! Yay, Siren. I have a Siren. Sirens are fun. Uh, that's annoying. Woo! Anyways, we're doing it. We're doing it. So. So. I'm playing like hot garbage. <laughs> um, I don't know. It, it's like, it's a different play style than mine, I think. Um, it part, partly the reason why I feel uncomfortable using it. Yeah, he just goes double duck. That's cool. Uh, but also... Okay, someone knows how to... Someone, someone's either a very patient breeder or somebody figured out their, uh, their, 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 their power saves pretty quickly there. Uh, you know, with the, the, the developer gold duck.
Polytail is really not threatened at all. The Trevenant is probably going to take like a hurricane or some crap. I don't want to toxic the gold duck, and I'm just, I think I'm just gonna go for a trick room, honestly. So if I get trick room up, this is great. If he tailwinds, he just ice beams into Trevenant. Okay. Oh, just under, just under half. If that, if that ice beam had just done a little bit more, such a spray would have activated. I mean, he made the he made the correct play, I guess. But is that damage roll? Because otherwise, if we get down to half. Such is very activated. So we survive that hurricane. Well, now we have no speed control, which sucks. I bring in the Metagross. I bring in the Metagross. Oh, I'm just not having a good time with this. Just not having a good time with this. Well, nothing else in the team is fast besides these two. So what do I want to do? I want to get rid of the. I really want to get rid of the gold duck. Probably for could switch out. I was in a headbutt there. He's, just, he's going for the water Z move onto Metagross, so I guess I could have protected, but ah. That's, that's gonna do a lot of damage, isn't it? That's gonna do a ton of damage, isn't it? Yeah, probably. Probably. Guess I could have just double protected there, but it's kind of worried about, like, just. I don't want to give him too much leeway to do whatever he wants. So, yeah, protect here would have been super chill. Yeah, that just knocks us out. Okay. This is not good at all. <laughs> oh man. Okay. 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 Guys, I am bad. Actually bad. Oh man. Double duck. Double suck. That's that's how I feel right now. Double suck. Woo! Moral of the story is, um, don't underestimate Z move. I mean, that was so obvious. Why didn't I just protect there? Doesn't help that it's like one in the morning. But probably should just protect it there. Because now, un unless unless the back two are Tapu Bulu and Marowak, I'm totally bazoned. I'm in the bone zone right now. Call that again. Poison jab that again. If you sell steel, I don't have a chance. Hydro pump. C can you miss a move? Seriously? Get lucky, why don't you? Get a little bit luckier, why don't you? And that's gonna burn us, isn't it? I love this game. I love it. I love it. Okay. Okay. Well. I'll tell you what's happening now. The siren again? Really? Jeez, is the whole city on fire? The muck just got burned. That's why the fire siren's going off. Very small fire, but they have very sensitive equipment over there. Anyways, yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, no, we're doing it, no, we're doing it, because I don't, this person doesn't care, and neither do I, I'm wasting everyone's time now, so, I'll take this time to say some things, um, I'm going to bring a team next week, and I think, I'm gonna want to bring is, um, 
Look, I think I'm gonna bring Torco back, but not with the Rangaroo, because the Rangaroo is, is absolutely hot garbage. Um, I think I'm gonna bring. I'm gonna be tripping like Torco, Porygon, definitely. Probably uh, Hariyama or something like that. Fake out support. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do something like that because uh, that, that's it's kind of what I feel like is good right now. I think I think wet like wet slow weather and Trick Room like Gigalith or Torkoal with Trick Room is super strong right now. I mean, I think I think Gigalith right now is really super strong, honestly. Top of Bulu. Okay. Well, obvious plays are obvious. Do we heal back now? So actually. I'm, gonna, I'm making the obvious play. And I need a crit. Let's knock this thing out. I need a crit. He's just he's just gonna wood hammer skull. He's just gonna wood hammer skull. A hurricane. Okay. Skull is stronger, but alright. Doesn't matter though. We have no HP anyways. And wood hammer. Okay, well. Killing me softly. With bullcrap tearing through my team. With bullcrap killing me softly. So this week right here, let's let's all just take a moment <laughs> to not to not to be super negative or anything. Let's all just take a moment to ponder the fact that. Low ladder is fun. I clearly am not comfortable with this team. Um, and it's, and it's, it's no fault of the team or the creator, it's just me. Um, and also low ladder is bad. And also this game is bad. And also, I'm not salty. I'm not salty at all, um, clearly. But, you know, you got good weeks and you got bad weeks. You look at last week we finished in, you know, like super high. We were... Like, what, 60 something in America? Not bad. Uh, and now we have to fight our way out of low ladder. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna come back next week with, I think, a Trick Room Torkoal team, probably. Something a little bit different uh, than before. Not not like just Oranguru and Struck Spam, because honestly, it's, that's not very strong. Oranguru is a bad Pokemon, in my opinion. And I thought it was good, but honestly, I don't think it's that good. It does nothing besides set up Trick Room take a lot of damage and then instruct and put off no offensive presence so i think porygon 2 is way better um i'm gonna i'm gonna build something off of that and i hope that you'll enjoy it and then we can you know maybe maybe i'll i'll do some battles off screen i think whoa whoa zoom i think i'll do some battles off screen maybe off screen off screen off stream off screen oh my god i'll do some battles that you won't see just to level us up maybe um Level us up. Ladder us up. That's the name of the series. How did I not remember that? I'm, I'm falling apart. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, just come back for another week of Ladder Up, because we're going to do better. It's going to be great, and I, I, I'm having fun anyways. So, don't forget to answer the, the question of the day, which was, if you, you're not playing Pokemon, what are you playing? Or what are you doing? And uh, I hope to see you guys back for another episode of Ladder Up.